<laughs> you gotta go. I gotta I gotta throw a new chain on the 81. Super bro, Justin. Uh, friends, I've taken care of some of the um, requests too. There was some video requests for sharpening an axe. How how excuse me, how I sharpen an axe. I call it my hard hard grind or uh, firewood grind, you know? Firewood edge. Um, I've done that. I've got the videos. It's pretty pretty good. I, I enjoyed making it actually. I'm I'm it's not brain science, friends. It really isn't. I find people trying to invent the freaking wheel again, reinvent the wheel too much. You know, and these old guys that have been it just it's not brain science. The thing has to be sharp, it has to be evenly edged, beveled. And uh, my goodness. Do you know what I mean? What's going on? Can I ask what your problem is? What's your problem? Did what? Somebody over there? Go get him then. We got a human being over there? Or deer? Who's that? Go get him. Go get him. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Oh no. Mustn't be that poor. Anyway, friends, uh, I gotta get moving. We're hopefully gonna cut today, but maybe not. And one of the young fallers who uh, you've heard me talk of the skinny kid, he uh, he came to me a year after I broke my back. So he'd have been 10 years ago, he'd have come here. I can't believe it's been 10 years. Wow. Uh, and I broke him in. Uh, climbing trees and falling and, and, and that. And then he went and turned himself into a, a faller, a West Coast faller. He, he's, he's gone full time. And uh, the boys that got a hold of him, I knew, right? I knew them. And uh, it was neat. It was real neat because when he, when he took his course, he was top of the class. You know what I mean? Falling course, he was top of the class. And the boys that, once he got out there, who were to take carrying on breaking them in, uh, called me. And they were like, Buck, and you done a nice job with this kid. You know what I mean? That's nice, eh? In our industry, that's a compliment. And, and, and that was nice, eh? And he's one hell of a kid. He's not a kid, no, he's a man. And, but when he come here, he was a kid, he couldn't even fire a power saw. He'd get pinched in every cut he did, and I joke about it with him to this day. Yeah, we laugh about it. He's a good, good guy, and he's gone straight up falling, and he's a good faller. He's a good faller. So uh, I'm proud of him. Real proud of him. Skinny kid, if you ever watch this, I'm damn proud of you. Anyhow, uh, let's get that 81 out and get going here on this. I'm going to put this axe away. I don't know who the lucky person is going to be. I don't care if this axe don't go nowhere. I freaking love this thing. Woohoo! I'm going to give it a wipe. Okay, friends. Good morning. Here we are. We we were up. We've had our coffee. Uh, Marius is here. He made it. Marius, say hi to everybody. Hi, peeps. <laughs> he made it. We picked him up last night at the ferry. It's all good. Uh, Chica's terrified. She's hiding out in the house there somewhere. But Marius is a great man and he's here and we're ready to go. So we got to go to Victor's now and grab some wood for the floor, for our floor. So my water pump's about to go on the Merc and I actually don't need that right now. I don't want to be going down the road loaded and, and just... So what I'm going to do is swap battery out and take the, uh, take the old one ton, the old one ton. So that's what we're in the process of doing. We're gonna go unload some steel that I cleaned up on the side here, right? Remember friends? I was cleaning all this up. Look at this patch, it's ready to go. I mean, we look good. There might be a little bit of this and a little bit of that once we get our forms down. There was a stump here. I've taken pretty much care of it, but we're building it up on piers, so it'll be fine. A little of this, a little of that. Don't forget about this. Now Marius, have you ever smelled old growth Douglas fir? I'll bet you haven't. Probably it is the most glorious smell in the world. Yeah, you, can you can actually smell it. It's it, the aroma is in the air. Friends, this, God, have a whiff of that, Marius. Oh, Isn't that nice smell? Yeah. That'll probably smell beautiful. Yeah, nice. <laughs> Isn't that nice? And the grain on this wood is, is just, it's to die for. Yeah, tight. Tight, tight, tight. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. So we'll be splitting some of that later, having some fun. We're going to go, friends. We're going to get the battery out of the crew cab here and go light up the one ton and get going. Go get some floorboards for this shack we're building. 
It's a glorious day, friends. It looks like the weather is shining on us. God's shining on us, Marius. Yep. Marius has got his still hat on, friends. <laughs> He's representing still. <laughs> you got me. What's in here? Oh, actually, the, the, the battery's in the Merc. Look at this still, friends. We're, we're ready. We got a good, a good situation going on here. Over. Damn it, I wish I had that on camera. Victor just went down and I missed it. I missed it, friends. So here we are, friends. We're at Victor's now. I'm not gonna talk long. We got work to do, but I just wanted to show you. This is, I fell this timber actually um, for Victor and his family when they were doing uh, doing this project. Yeah, right there. And, and here it is, two by six, two by eight. We're gonna go two by eight just because. These are 20 feet long. I think they're 16. 16, 6 or 17, 6. This is, this is long, Vic. There might be some, some longs in there. Oh, oh, there, the, yeah, there's a one log. Yeah. Sorry, uh, and those are, yeah. Oh, yeah, and it's not a full two, is it? No, it should be. It's all, it's all dimensional lumber, so. Yeah, they cut it uh, one and a bit or whatever they call it, which is, which is good, which is fine, Vic. So, we'll probably peel that top layer. Yeah. And go at it. Exactly. Okay, so we're gonna load up, friends. Wood for the floor. It's gonna be sweet. Talk to you in a bit. Let it run for a minute or two. Let's do that again. That's right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you weren't working, Maria. No, friend. Stop. That's right. I don't think they see it that way. No, they don't. <laughs> no, they don't. <laughs> Okay, friends, we're down on uh, we're down on uh, Victor's property, actually. Oh, this looks nice, Vic. This is is this Stevenson's Point? No, this was uh, downtown Nanaimo. Well, that makes sense. It was off of uh, can't remember, just off Northfield away. This is nice wood. Yeah. Very nice. Oh yeah. Compared to. Yeah, I saw that. Production wood. Yeah, look at that. Where'd that come from? Um, what you call it? They're uh, not an Animal Lakes. The uh, sprucing. Yeah. Just you mean just just going to get firewood? You mean? Well, I shoveled uh shoveled the guys in to their firewood processor, and they gave me three quarters of wood. Right. Oh, and they came and dumped it. Yeah. Oh, lovely. So, friends, we're on Victor's uh, uh, family's property here, North Nanaimo. And there's been a tree down here that I know it's been here for years and it is not not that far from Victor's and I've been here several times But I've never come down to this tree and it's right on the edge of the property and it is so cool friends. It's another monster It's just off their property It's just off their property, which sucks because it's not theirs, but it's so cool. It may as well be. Oh, it's fenced it's nobody's. Yeah, it's it's well, it's this farmers Vic. I think no, because, uh, Oh my dear lord right there, right? <laughs> what do you think of that, Marius? That's nice. That's a Douglas fir. Friends, this is a beauty. This is, again, this is another one of those, uh, like a residuals. So these people, oh, it's nobody's. You're right. It's nobody's because of the water. Yes, that's right. So that is a specimen that's going to be there forever. Ever. That Unless is... It comes down by itself. That's a six-footer. Oh, yeah. 
That that's a six Easy. foot, maybe yeah. seven. I could lay down on that, and I think still have yeah. some room. Yeah, that's a six foot fir, friends, and and that's big, eh? I mean, that's a big tree, and it's old growth. It's an old growth. I want to climb it one day. Well, it'd be a beautiful climb. Be a beautiful climb. Has it had the top knocked out of it, or do you know? No, it's still got it's it's, still it's got, got, got it's got the it's got the crown. You can see it from back. <laughs> I bet you could see it from over there. You can, but you can see it off the back end of the property. Yeah, you look at. You can just see the crown sticking out. Yeah, I mean here it is, and it, it's got a lean. Oh, that's that's you're freaking right. That's six foot, seven foot across. Oh yeah. Oh, it's it's a it's a dandy. <laughs> She's soaking wet. It is. Oh, for sure it is. That, that. Because yeah, I've hopped this fence many a time. It's and... six, just over six, I'll bet. Oh, look at this. We got the river. So what is this? Millstone River. This is the Millstone River. Look at this, friends. Look at these. The little millstone. Little this millstone. is cool. This is really neat down here. And to have that old girl. Oh, yeah, the, the top is in her. Oh, yeah. You can see it. I'll show it to you. Yeah, you okay. You can see it off the okay. corner of the property. This is interesting. Does this come from Brandon Lake or yeah. something? Yeah. The mountain feeds it off of uh, Mount Benson Falls. Yes. Falls into Brandon Lake along with a million other streams. Okay. But, and then dumps out of Brandon Lake. Very cool. Very cool. That's, that's a beauty. I knew this thing was here and we'd never come down to it. So that's a beauty, friend. And and healthy as heck, hey friends? Like it is, it's healthy. Well, it's a but but look at the second growth in here, friends. L look at the freaking second growth. Look at this thing. It's like farm fur. Somebody's been shooting at this. Look at that. Target practice. Previous owner. Yeah, you like see, I mean, th this target. this second growth is fat, friends. These furs are, we got, on Vancouver Island, we got four and five foot second growth in areas, 100 and, 80 200 foot it's it's still here Play, oh it's just in that second growth that version. one on the fence lines for four or five oh it is yeah it almost looks like old second growth yeah oh guaranteed yeah okay friends i, I want to answer a question for somebody right now and and uh, uh this is it the, the, this is the horse's mouth right here like this is there's no doubt there's no stories this is live straight coming at you People ask me, why do you, why, why do you put glue in your wedges and your axes or, or, or to glue or to not to glue? Well, Victor, when did you, when did you seat this ax? Long time a ago. A long time ago, yeah. over a year ago. Oh yeah, easy. This is two years. Two years. So yeah. he seated this ax two years ago. It's just a no-name brand, Chinese brand, double bit, nice handle. Uh, but look, friends, look at it. It works itself out. It's working itself out. Especially that it's an outside axe too, right? It yeah. gets the moisture, swells, pushes it. That's right. But if there was out, glue in it, it would have stayed. Yeah. It, 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 it doesn't matter yep. what it's doing. So, friends, glue's a, glue's a good... I've torn apart so many axes, friends, and wedges will just fall out. So, yeah. glue... Especially if you're not doing flat wedges or that's round right. wedge. That's you right, to hold it in. Yep. You got to glue them. Glue your wedges in, friends. If you're if you're using it, wall hangers, no biggie. But but I mean, Vic's using this, and that, and that wedge is working itself out. Just wanted to show you that. It's interesting as we go along. There's going to be many many stories and myths broken at this channel, Marius. <laughs> Victorious, friends. I, I just want to show you this 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 tree. This is the fence line. I mean, you know, the, this this is a monster. But but what this is, friends, this is in the middle. Do you know what I mean? It's old, old second growth, if that makes sense. It it it's almost like it, it it's this it's is a sapling when they were taken out. Exactly. Though. It's like First. it was just bypassed when they lost. I mean, it is a monster, but but it is second growth, friends. It is. It's second growth. And it's I would say it's four foot. Oh, yeah. It's a four foot tree. Yeah, especially once you get over the snow. In the, yeah, wow, beautiful tree. 
Nice cylinder. Yeah, see, I mean, look at the size of the second growth. That's a monster second growth. Oh, that's, that's the size of... Yeah, look at that. So, friends, here we are. We, we're, down at the, we're down at the freaking uh, airplane thing here. Me, Victor, and Marius. And we're waiting for these characters to show up. And here they are. So, let's just put this here. No, that's not it. Oh, I can't. Who's that? It looks like these characters. I was gonna, but I thought, yeah. It looks like it looks like you're packing axe. <laughs> I have them. Oh, do you? Nice, buddy. They're in the Hello Kitty bag. He's got. Them. Hi, boys. All right. Here we are, fellas. Sweet. Come here, buddy. Good to see you. Good to see you. Awesome. Man. Yeah. Sir. Do you know the landscape? Hey. Yeah. Good to see you, guys. I'm glad you made. Give me some. What, was this your luggage? Uh, you. Who's the young one? Get out of here. Gitty? Sorry, I put you guys in my pocket. Spencer McGinty, say hi to YouTube. Hi, guys. <laughs> Saw Surgeon, say hi. How's the YouTube? <laughs> this is nuts, Fred. Just heap your. Sh okay, listen, let's throw your stuff in the back of Victor's because. It's the crew cab. Just heap all this in the back of Victor's. He's got his Arvika here, friends. So it'll be nice and cozy with the Arvika. Look at Landfill's pretty case. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that nice? That's gorgeous. So how was the freaking journey, boys? Oh, great. Was it? No. Smooth? Yeah. Doug, did you bring something? Decal, what's in that? It's all merch. <laughs> Okay, friends, so we're going to get, you know, going here and get these guys situated. We'll talk to you in a little bit. Decal, say hi to everybody. You're both the only guy that didn't say hi. There we go. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. My wife sewed that on for me. She did have a Well, actually, we beat him to the airport because it was so crazy. We pulled into the parking lot. He calls me, and he pulled in behind us. You want to talk about time? Are you kidding me? No, he was there five minutes after we were, maybe ten minutes. <laughs> Friends, we're we're heading home. We got uh, we got the saw surgeon and decal and Marius, and we're all pretty hungry. So we're just uh, we're getting settled. Everything's going off without a hitch, except for a couple of things at the airport that they uh, got delayed on. Well, I mean, look at the surgeon; he's scary as hell. Yeah, <laughs> 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 no mirrors in the house, eh? Oh, that's lovely. So we're going home to eat. We'll see you back at the ranch. Good morning, friends. I'm going to do... How's everybody doing? I hope you're all doing well. Uh, I'm just uh, editing a video. And here, let me just shut this up. Um, so as you all know, um, this was our first day. We've got a wicked crew of guys here. There'll probably be some other stuff, friends. Uh we're going to just be kind of we're, we're going to go live we're going to do some live stuff um friends there's i'm doing my best to pluck away at the emails if you've sent me emails uh, i'm going to get to some here today and that just bear with me on the communication and the things i'm hosting 10 men and we're going steady so i'm just going to keep you looped day to day like i usually do in that and we'll do some little vloggity doggities and I'll just be in and out. So the content is going to be kind of all over. Um, you know what I mean? And we're going to hopefully do like a, a, a time lapse through the whole thing. I'll just, uh, you know what I mean? And uh, Willard. Oh, good. W Will do showed up, friends. <laughs> Will do showed up. He's actually coming out. He brought his camper. He's in the field. He's coming in for coffee right now. It's 10 to 7. The boys will be here an hour. We're going to start on this thing. Uh, it's going to be fun, friends. It's going to be good footage, but it is going to be good. Make sure, yeah, let him in. Thanks, Marius. Um, so I, just just uh, people who are trying to get a hold of me as far as emails and stuff, uh, if I haven't answered you, 
it's for an obvious reason, but I'm gonna be poking in there and doing that. So just doing my best to kind of host the fellas and, and keep this thing moving, keep everybody happy, including you. So uh, just work with me on that. And uh, it's gonna be a fun week, friends. The weather looks good. We're pretty stoked. Uh, so have a great day. Be kind, friends. And uh, just keep shooting off in the comment section and, and ask any questions and we'll do the best we can for you. Okay, friends, over and out. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you soon.